We all have hopes and dreams for our kids, that they will live happy, active lives, and that they will get a good education and a good job, and that they will grow up to contribute something positive to the world. But for some parents, it's hard to make plans that far in the future. Many of them simply live for the day, praying that their daughter makes it through the night without much pain, that one day their son learns to walk, or that their child lives to see her next birthday. Day in and day out, they face the heartbreak of their child's disability or disease, or the disappointment of one medical crisis after another. When we have healthy kids, it's easy to forget how fortunate we are, how truly blessed we are to have children who can run and play, go to school, make plans for the future. Because of that blessing, we are called on to remember those children who are less fortunate than our own, those children who need our help. In Arkansas, we're fortunate to have one of the world's leading children's hospitals that provides some of the most advanced medical care available. At Arkansas Children's Hospital, dedicated nurses and doctors, technicians, physical therapists, and others commit their lives to the compassionate care of our most seriously ill and injured children. But their ability to care for these children depends to a large extent on the generosity of Arkansas's people. Since 1993, loggers and other friends of forestry have helped purchase life-saving medical equipment and provide important services to sick children through their generous contributions to the Log a Load for Kids program. Arkansas's logging and forestry communities work hard to carry the load for kids and support our children's hospital through the Log a Load for Kids campaign. Well, we like to say, you know, in the Log a Load program, and I know everyone's heard it, but uh, uh, we like to say that uh, trees are our most renewable resource, but the children are our most valuable resource. And, uh, you know, uh, loggers and forestry people, uh, uh, we want to take care of our lands, uh, and we want to also take care of our children. And through the log load program, that gives us an opportunity to do that. Whether it's a fish fry at the county fairgrounds or a crawfish boil at a sawmill, log -a load events bring the community together with a common goal to help make miracles happen. Every penny raised through local events goes to help the patients at Arkansas Children's Hospital. As the log -a load for kids program has grown over the years, it has become a significant source of funding for the hospital and has made a big impact on the care it can provide its young patients. Everyone here at Arkansas Children's Hospital very much appreciates the very fine support we get from the state's loggers and the forestry community through the log -a load program for children. Because of people like you, a child may learn to walk, may be well enough to spend a birthday at home, or may be able to return to school with his friends. By sharing what they earn from taking care of Arkansas's amazing renewable resource, its forests, the forestry community makes a difference in the lives of our most precious resource, our children. With your help, we can put a smile on the face of a child in pain. So the next time you see a log truck on the road, think about the people who grow the trees, those who harvest the timber, and the people who process it into the products we use and enjoy every day. And remember that they are also giving kids a chance to grow up and become tomorrow's generation of Arkansans.